I'm Reverend L. L. Dubrell of Faith United Church of Christ in Union, New Jersey, and I need to make two points tonight. The first one, my colleagues already know. It is assumed when you're a person of devout faith that you hold certain beliefs and you are for or against certain things. I represent an organization called We've Been Waiting. I represent the United Church of Christ, which on a national level has come out in support of gay marriage. So I am here asking you to not paint us with all the same paintbrush as well. And know that our belief in the inclusive love of God should be reflected in our inclusive love of each other. That's the first point. The second point, again, nothing dramatic, but it's my story. We have many celebrations in our church of families coming together. We have all sorts of christenings. We have all sorts of recognizing a family in the making. And one of those things we recognize is called marriage. And at the end of a marriage ceremony, I am given permission to say, by the law of the state of New Jersey, I now pronounce you married. The state walks into my sanctuary when I do what has been called a covenant ceremony, sometimes now a civil union that I call a sacred union, and the state takes those words against out of, of the possibility of me saying them. The state walks into my church and tells me I am not allowed to do something and say words that are not only affirmed by my personal faith, my denominational tradition, but I believe words that need to be said to recognize fully and completely a marriage that God has ordained and blessed us. Thank you.